I feel like this is three. Jesse, will you meet th mute three? Ready, Yo. ready. Yo. Uh, uh, no, just, yeah, so now nah, we're just nah, 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 brown and nah, red. Nah. Dun, dun, dun. Oh. I'm not gonna interrupt Devin Dawson. Orange, red, and brown. Tomorrow. <laughs> He's like, ah. <laughs> uh, all right, ACMs. We're backstage right now with Devin Dawson, who uh, got a nomination this year for new I did. male vocalist here. That had to feel awesome. It's insane, man. And for me, I think like it's very early on in my career to even like I, I had was not expecting anything. Mm -hmm. Like my album had just come out, my single was you know kind of still working, and it's crazy to just get that it's an honor you know to have them kind of give me that nod like that i'm very grateful yeah it's really cool as you reflect on on watching that journey of all on me um what do you kind of take away from it or how do you explain it to other because i'm sure you have a lot of friends in the industry that haven't had that moment yet even though they're maybe successful songwriters and yeah um i i just think i mean i think hard work hard work warrants luck but i just think just I don't know, man. It's so I don't know how to explain it. It's just like you kind of watch it have a mind of its own almost. Mm -hmm. um, and I and I work my ass off because I love what I do, and so I never clock out, you know. Yeah. Um, but beyond that, you still have to have music that impacts people, and I guess that's the answer: is that somehow, in some way, the song made people feel something and made them emotionally um, impacted in some way, you know. And I guess that's the answer for me, anyways, as a songwriter. And is I need to say something. I need mm -hmm. to have some sort of substance, whether it's a love song or a heartbreak song or a song about my life or whatever, you know. I think it's safe to say there isn't anyone in country music like you. Uh, the album Dark Horse is great. The title track is is amazing. Thank you. But I, there had to be people that were like kind of pushing and pulling and like. You know, maybe more of this, or trying to shape you, and you kind of—I yeah. don't know if you swatted them away. I think, or... I think during the shaping of people wanting to do that was more about like when I was building my team, and I think I was attracted to the people that just allowed me to be what I wanted to be, or more more so believed in just who I was, right? Mm -hmm. And the people that brought things out of me genuinely that I didn't know I had, that really kind of shined a light on the inner on the inner me, as cheesy as that sounds. And I think that's how I chose my team. That's how I chose the people that surrounded me because they're extensions of me. And if you're trying to make me be something else, then it's not going to work <laughs> because I just go with my gut at the end of the day, man. Um, yeah. And that's what's gotten me this far so far. So I'm going to just try to keep doing that as much as I can. Vegas, you come here. Are you a guy that uh, you like to just be by yourself and, and kind of you know sit at a table for a while? You're man. like the big crowd around you? I, I think I think at my core I am a, I'm an introvert because it, the definition of the two is if you're introverted, you are replenished by being by yourself. Right. If you're an extrovert, you're replenished by being with other people. Mm -hmm. And I think to replenish my energy, I need to be by myself. But that being said, I've kind of been forced to be an extrovert because I see all my friends that I don't, yeah. I don't ever get to see because I'm on the road all the time. Right. And it's always so short. We got three minutes to catch up, and and same with you guys. We have a couple minutes and. I don't know. I just try to take in as much time as I can with the people I love around me when I'm in Vegas and, and enjoy the enjoy the time. I think too when you're around people that you know, then you're not spending as much energy as an introvert. Exactly. So you're not ways. trying. You're yeah. just existing. You yeah. know, and that's that's the key right there for sure. Yeah. Always cool to hang with you, man. Yeah, I appreciate cool you saying dude. what you said, and um, I, you know, I'm a huge Johnny Cash fan growing up, and I think he was no one was like him before him, and no one will ever be like him after him. Mm -hmm. And for you to say that there's no one like me in country music is, is a huge honor. So thank you yeah. very much. Appreciate Thanks it. Thanks so much. Devin Dawson hanging out with us at the 53rd ACM Awards, of course, Sunday night, 8, 7 Central on CBS. Thank you, dude. I appreciate it. Yeah, Seriously, that means a lot, dude. Dude, yeah, it's true. There is no, it's, you're almost hard to describe to That's, people that don't.